I'm afraid I'm not gonna be able to get it too, too cheap. I was just like so seduced by it that I kind of lost track of everything. Oh, I just realized it has a massive hole. Hi. Hello. Today we're trying out jackets. So we're trying out jackets because they're still weather appropriate right now, but we still want to look fashionable while covering up our day-to-day -day clothes. I love jackets. You do. I personally have too many for Southern California. <laughs> I have a lot of statement jackets mm -hmm. with like fun dangly bits and embroidery and denim and all this cool stuff. But what I kind of don't have is like a classic but still interesting trench coat. Ooh. Oh. I've always wanted a trench coat. I feel like it'll make me look like a classy spy lady. I don't have as many like jackets as Nina's talking about. I have like statement coats mm -hmm. or like long light jackets. What I'm looking for today is that like long but not too stuffy type of coat that still brings the fashion. I'm gonna go kind of like simple because I've always wanted an oversized denim jacket. For some reason, and I haven't been able to find one, even though it's super simple. I kind of want a black one that's like distressed. That's my okay. ideal. Okay. But I would also go with blue if, if I have to. Okay. <laughs> and with a jean jacket, you can put it with athletic wear, you could put it with fancy wear, you could wear yeah. them with everything. So we usually find the cheapest thing we can online, which we're still gonna do, but I have decided I want to try and get something that is used, like secondhand, like thrifting, but online, which there are some stores you can do that online. For sure. Me being straight sized, I can easily get secondhand clothes. So I felt like because I'm able to do this, I might as well showcase that there are options outside of fast fashion. I think that's a really good idea. You can move around the shopping space very easily. easily, you know? And we know this, we've yeah. talked about this all before. I find it generally pretty hard to find plus size gowns. Finding inexpensive jeans may be one thing. Finding inexpensive jeans in my size, that's the thing. My biggest difficulty comes with like, when you get into two pieces because my chest is like pretty big for my frame. We don't need to buy fast fashion for you. Like you have many other options, yeah. so try it out. So then after we do the cheap option, we're gonna bring in a stylist and she She's gonna show us the equivalent of what we're buying, but very, very fancy and expensive, which is always nice. It's difficult because with fast fashion, it's so cheap that even thrifted stuff is usually more expensive, but it is important for the environment, so I may have to pay a little more. I'm gonna search for some printed trench coats, I think, so I can get something a little bit cooler. The first thing I'm doing is I'm going to the outlet on ASOS. I'm starting on Depop because it's cool and a oversized denim jacket is cool. Printed women's trench coat, let's give it a look-see. You see, I really like this, but it's $119. $36 for a coat is cheap. Something like this, 36 isn't bad. I can't really tell what's going on with it. God, these are also expensive. So my goal is I want it to be an actual coat. I'm afraid I'm not gonna be able to get it too, too cheap. This one is 26 bucks. This is a 90s vintage denim jacket and it's cheap. It does say it's a 2X, but modeled on a medium and she's 5'2". I'm a lot taller than that. It might look shorter on me. Well, this one's interesting. It's $40. I'm, I'm trying to go lower. 39, that's... that's Pretty cheap. I don't know if that's like, I don't want like a leather jacket. So I'm on Poshmark since there's a lot more options. I really like this one. I did want something that was a little more distressed in the colors, like it's all one color, which I don't love. I searched trench coat on this like a Romwe. There's definitely some trench coats, but none of them are printed. I might reshift my strategy. Let's just go like with a print coat and maybe some of them will be trenchy. I went to, you know, my website and there's a definite sale. This one is more like what I'm looking for with the like lighter color here. I don't understand the padding. This one is trench-esque, but it's not like quite a full coat. Like it doesn't have buttons. I love grid printed stuff. And also this is super cheap. It's $13.45. This coat is $30. It comes in my size. It's an actual stylish coat. 
I think this is it. Literally, I'm so stuck. It's between this and this. This just kind of looks like, you know, it's like oversized in a cool way and then oversized in I just put on my dad's jacket. This one though has no body in it. It's just a hanging jacket. I found this coat that's equally pretty cheap and has interesting buttons. It's just black. It's not really what I'm looking for. You know what? It's $20. Let's try and make an offer. I think at this point, my best option is probably the grid print one. When I put it into my cart, got a little honey discount. So it was actually only 10.46, which you cannot beat that price. It's a few hours later and they accepted my offer. Only $17. I just have to hope it was good in person. They're here. I have a fur collar that wasn't in the picture. That wasn't? No. <laughs> Luckily, it's re removable, I think. Okay. okay. Yeah. Look, Where'd you yes, get it from? I got it from Poshmark. This doesn't look used, I don't think. No. no. It's exactly what I was looking for. It's distressed. It's distressed. It's black. It's long. Like, yeah. oh, I just realized it has a massive hole. It's like fully a hole. That's though. like, <laughs> that's a lot. Hmm. What's the other arm? Does it have that too? Oh, yeah. Okay, so I've got two open arms. Maybe your cool. elbows are just supposed to be out. I'm like really pissed that she didn't take photos of this part because that's like something that isn't normal in a jacket like oh yeah it's a real hole it's like fully gonna be like half my arm i really liked this at first wow i like hearing you mad now you know how we feel no i'm kidding oh, <laughs> it's true it's true i'm always like oh this is fine <laughs> oh it fits oh, me it's great. <laughs> the one thing i will say about this is it was only 17 dollars, so like that okay. is pretty cheap and it's not bad quality we'll see what it looks like on maybe it will look amazing who knows this is a f coat it really is this is a coat it's heavy feels nice. than i thought oh, it's yeah. definitely not an animal but no. it's, it's like, like a pelt i've never owned something like this before so this was 30 dollars. that is insanely That's cheap crazy. yes i would see this being like a hundred dollar coat honestly. exactly i'm excited to try it yeah it's just not what i expected to be honest yeah. how about you okay so <laughs> show us i have yes this coat. Is it a coat? Unclear. It's like a very crepey material. It's stretchy. Yeah. Which was kind of unclear Un online. I mean, I knew it wasn't going to be like thick, thick like that, but I thought it was going to have maybe a little more structure. It's more in the category of like a shawl. I was going to say a shawl. Or like a blazer. And it's not bad. It's just not what I was expecting. Like, like I said, I wanted something trenchy. I really love the pattern. I love a grid print. Um, do you? Yes, I do. I love your pants. <laughs> when I saw the grid print, I was just like so seduced by it that I kind of lost track of everything else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to be fair, it was $10.46. Oh so. my God. It's just not going to keep you warm. This is like something you keep in the office in case it gets yeah. chilly. Was it's it not called like... a jacket? Yeah. Yeah. All right, All right, I guess we'll try them on and see what's up. Yeah, go. You go. Oh, I go. Bye. Yay, come out, Chloe. Come out, Chloe. Let's see it. Woo. Woo. What do you think? Well, <laughs> yeah, elbows out. <laughs> I just don't understand. Thanks. <laughs> That keeps me warm, actually. Your hands are warmer than the jacket. It's not oversized. It's just long. No, it's not oversized. It's not physically what you wanted, mm -hmm. but it is achieving the look of making things just like chill. Yeah, it's not horrible. Like, no. I do like it. I still like the design of it. I just don't understand how they can call it oversized when I can't even do it up. How do you feel about your exposed elbows? Don't understand. Like, if I start to like fold my arms, there's just nothing but elbows. You know, it'd be cool <laughs> if you took a pair of fishnets and <gasps> sewed it. Oh my God, that's a great idea. Yeah. Cause I don't like my elbows. They're a bit dry. Uh, and <laughs> just like showing through. I think it's someone else's turn. Nina. Ooh. Try on that shawl. <laughs> Come out! <laughs> I think it's pretty generous to call this a jacket or coat of yeah. any kind. It's just like so thin. Why is this not? I know, it's the thing that bothers me the most is the yeah. pattern not being there. No matter what I try to do, there's always some of the inside that shows and I'm like, yeah. I really wanted a nice spring jacket. It's really a shawl, but it feels weird because shawls are usually like a thicker, softer material and uh -huh. this is just like a crepe. I don't know. I just don't know what to make of it. I know this works for someone. But who? <laughs> It's not bad, but the people that I could think that would wear stuff like this, this isn't the material. But it was only $10. And don't get us wrong, it doesn't look bad. No. But I'm just like, I'm confused. Now it's your turn. It's it is. is. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. bye. Come on out, Jazzy Let's Pants. Let's see your fancy coat. Hi. 
Oh, oh. I love yeah. this. I mean, it's beautiful. It's really good. When I first saw it, because I was expecting kind of like an in between of a jacket and a coat, mm -hmm. like not so heavy, I was a little surprised. But putting this on, I feel like it looks luxurious. It does. Definitely does. Like it's a look too. It's yeah. fashionable. It's neutral enough where you can wear it with like your cropped up oh, in your jeans. Totally. Exactly. It, like, it elevates that, but nothing else like brings it down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The only thing is it is a little like shetty. Oh, oh, yeah. I bet maybe if you washed it though. Yeah. The more I look at it, the more I'm like, okay. It really does look cool. I like, yeah. this is random, but I like the kind of flappy bit. It goes yeah. the back. in the back. Oh, does it? Yeah, yeah. it's like a whole cool. thing here. Yeah. The one thing I do think though is, which I think this is very similar with these coats in general, if you were to close them, they look like robes. <laughs> yes. So leave That's it open true. for $30. That's crazy. I don't know how much Ooh. better we can get, but we will see with our stylus. Yes, we will. We're going to bring her in. Yes. Hello. Hello! Hi guys, how are ya? Good. Got some fun jackets for you! Yay! Very how did everything go before? Uh, it was a little bit of a miss. Okay. There were some highs and lows. Jazz was, was amazing! Great. Yay! <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go with you first. Uh, so, I'm the easiest one because oh, I do are not we? like mine. Oh no! <laughs> okay, okay, well then I hope you like this new glare jacket. The lines on it are so cool, so gorgeous. Your elbows are never getting out of here. <laughs> Look how wide the arms are. I I'm curious. Love that. I think well, you wanted oversized. Yeah, I think that's gonna give you that real oversized, oversized effect look. that you wanted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can already tell this is way closer to what I wanted to oh, get. Yay. So this okay. is fashion also. Yeah. I love it. I think it's like you could cool. easily wear this with so many looks. You can make it super casual in daytime. I just think with a denim jacket, you can get so many outfits out of it. Let's throw it on. Bye. 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 Chloe, Let's come see out. You. Ooh, that's Ooh, cute. Yeah. yeah. That's cute, right? I like it. I like it a lot. Do you like it? I do like it. Okay. I'm not used to like huge sleeves like this, but I looked in the mirror and I decided to warm to it. I love all of these lines because mm -hmm. they take it from being like that goodwill jacket that you just kind of <laughs> yeah. distress on your own yeah. to something that feels like it still looks casual and cool, but it like feels fancy. How much is this? This is nine ninety. Woo! Mm -hmm. wow. A denim jacket you better get a lot of use yeah. out of. <laughs> I feel like that's very like worth it. I mean, you could use this for years and years. Like right. I could see you literally like being a mom in 10 years and still wearing this jacket. Yeah. Why is this so expensive? Like, are there genuine reasons for it? Or is it literally just a brand name? <laughs> I mean, I think with some brands, absolutely. However, with something like this, the denim on it, I'm sure you can feel the difference between this denim and your previous yeah, one. Totally. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be a lot thicker. Yeah. It might be a little bit softer because they've actually done a lot to treat the denim. Where they actually source the denim is gonna be different, right? It might be from Italy. And then on top of it, you're usually having someone check every single piece that comes out. They're making sure that everything lines up and looks perfect as it's supposed to be. Yeah. So they might be doing the sewing by hand versus being manufactured. Okay. So here's the thing, you could probably go to Forever 21 two months from now and find something similar, but the quality of it, you can have this jacket for years and years and years mm -hmm. where something from Forever 21 or you know somewhere else, it's not gonna hold up to that. Well, I'm impressed with it. So who is okay. next? Neens. Neens. Okay, Nina, we have a trench coat for you. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh. Wow. wow. Is this real? It is a vegan <laughs> snake print trench. That's amazing. Feeling. I love it. This is insane. It's lighter and it has that springy feel that I was kind of going for. This is more of kind of an overcoat. You're gonna just throw it on and walk out the door, wear it at night, whatever it is. It's not for warmth, it is for showing off. That's <laughs> what I need. Yes. Yeah. How much is it? Uh, this is 860. Oh. Oh, I think it looks like it's worth more than that. I would agree. A jacket that's vegan, you know, unless you're getting like an Anushka or something along those lines, isn't gonna really hit that high, high, high price point. Well, I'm glad it's vegan this yeah. time. Okay. Should I try it on? I try it should. on. Try it. Nina, come show Hi. us. Ooh. Ooh. So fancy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is exactly what you wanted. I know. Yeah. This, is <laughs> this is exactly so it. Better. I feel like a fashion villain. It is a statement. It is light. It is a trench. It's, it's everything you need, except this needs to flop that way. <laughs> yeah, it's just like so cool. Mm -hmm. I like can't get over the cool factor of it all. It's so comfortable. It's warm, but it's not the kind of thing that's like gonna suffocate me, you know, yeah. with heat. It's not a leather. A terrible. leather's gonna be heavy. Yeah, yeah it's, it's yeah. light. I don't own anything snakeskin, and I've never really seen my 
himself in that print before. <laughs> I just really like it. Yeah. 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 You need to wear more snake skin because it looks really yeah. good on you. You need to. That might be your new like Ooh, thing. Yeah. You should look into that. For something like this, is it pricey because of like the brand name? Granted, I don't know that brand. Or is this it is like an Italian brand, so wherever they're sourcing their materials from, can it again be better quality? So if it was real snakeskin, that would be, I mean, obviously just an estimate, but maybe closer to like $4,000. But since it is vegan, it is more affordable, and it's also better for animals. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so. so it's a steal. Yes. <laughs> My cheaper version was a light fabric, way lighter than this. <laughs> yeah, it was barely a fabric. <laughs> but this still feels light, but it still has the structure. Like you get this like double collar that sits the way like yeah. a collar is supposed to sit. <laughs> mm -hmm. Which I think is cool because it doesn't feel like too overwhelmingly structured, but it's right. enough to like make it look like I'm wearing a jacket. I'm not taking you. Okay. <laughs> you don't have to. <laughs> it's Jazz's turn, so hey, yay. Show me the curve. Ooh. Oh, I oh, love yes. Oh my god, the color. This is so I nice. I love this color. Wow. It's so different for like a cheetah print jacket. Yeah. Kind of the purple gray, and this is 998. Okay. Oh, wow. I know. Oh. It has a little bit of wool in it, so it's not so, so heavy. Yeah. Right? I think it's like 30% wool or something like that. It's not going to be itchy. It's going to still keep you warm. It's pretty light seasons. comparatively. Yeah. yeah, your other one was white. It was heavy. Okay, That's let's go cool. get it on. Okay. Get it on. Yeah, put it on. We'll see. <laughs> Jesse! Wow, that was creepy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It is cute. I feel like elevated. I feel like it's still me, but it's a little bit more mature, a little mm. bit more classy. It's a little bit more stylish. I feel very New York. You have New York inspiration. Yeah, guys. I always <laughs> feel New York when you dress me. This coat actually came in a hazelnut color too, but I just wanted to go with something a little bit more fun, a little mm -hmm. pop of color. And I love it. The brushed like leopard on it's awesome. Yeah. The satin on the lining, so cute, what you see right oh, yeah, here. Yeah, it's really nice. I like that yeah. it's full length. I feel like I could wear a tank top and like jeans underneath totally. this. I could also put like, a sweater or a turtleneck underneath this. What do you think about the brand? I mean, I obviously know Kate Spade is a thing. A yeah. lot of my friends who are also plus size love Kate Spade, so I'm not surprised that I like it. It's nowhere where I would have looked, yeah. but yeah. yeah. When you say Kate Spade, I don't automatically think Jasmine. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I also don't think clothes a lot of the time. No, I think no. like those traveling I think, bags. Yeah, yeah. So we all love our jackets and I feel like I know what the answers are gonna be, but I have to ask Syl, which one do you prefer, cheap or expensive? I mean, mine's not really a contest. I prefer the expensive one. Mm. Of course, when you have more money, it's easier to get what you're looking for. Yes. Yeah. My cheap jacket was a weird compromise of confusion of things. <laughs> but this, it's so classic in like, construction, but like the print makes it cool and feel modern. Between cheap and expensive, there is some price point where yeah. I could get something similar to this that's more affordable, but picking between the two. <laughs> How about you? Okay, I'm struggling. Oh, yeah, because yours, yours is really a tough choice. Uh, mine is a tough choice, yeah. and here's the thing. I'm going to say I pick the expensive. I love how it makes me feel. I love that it's lighter. I'm only picking the expensive by like literally one point. I love them both. I think it's pretty obvious that I'm gonna choose this one. <laughs> Not that I hated my cheap one, but I just wish I had known a little bit more. You hated I it. I kinda hated it. <laughs> <laughs> I paid for elbows, didn't get oh, elbows. Oh man. But what I was mainly sad about with that is when I pulled it out of the box when I got it, it looked really cool and I was initially really excited about it, so I think I had higher expectations. You aced it, Taylor. Oh, you did. You did really well. Thanks, guys. You always do good, yeah, but. Yes. Well, well, sometimes it's harder. Sometimes I feel like totally. certain, certain clothing items are harder to do than others. But I think that's it. I think we can say goodbye. Yeah. Yes. Yep. Okay. All right. Thanks for watching. Farewell. <laughs> Bye.